Just before we dive into this article, guys, I just want to say I apologize. There's a lot of names of actors, producers, and executives, and not actually hearing the name out loud, I'm not sure how to pronounce a lot of these names. So I'm going to do my best to try and read the article featuring the names of the executives, actors, producers. I may pronounce them wrong, so I do apologize. Just a side note. Anyway, guys, let's jump into the hey video. Hey, guys, and welcome to this video on the new Sonic the Hedgehog spin off series. Knuckles at Paramount Plus sets its cast, including Adam Pally and Tika Sumter. So yeah guys, I'm really super excited to see that Knuckles is getting his own TV show on Paramount Plus. The first movie was a big surprise hit, I think, for a lot of people. It had, had oodles of charm and people found out Jim Carrey was going to be in it and Jim Carrey playing Robotnik was just the icing on the cake. He was so good and um, he brought so much heart and so much charm to that movie. But yeah, anyway guys, so let's jump into this Variety article and let's uh, see what it says about the new Knuckles TV show. So, the live-action Knuckles series starring I Idris Elba at Paramount Plus has assembled its cast. This is exciting. The show was first announced in February 2022, in addition to Elba reprising his role as Knuckles from Sonic the Hedgehog 2. Sonic is really good, guys. If you haven't uh, if you hadn't had a chance to see it, I would really recommend watching both the Sonic movies. Um, there's a really good after credit scene in Sonic 2, so if you do watch Sonic 2, make sure you uh, watch the after credits uh, scene as well. Uh, Variety has learned that Adam Pally from Happy Endings, The Mindy Project, is set to star in the series, once again playing the role of Wade Whipple from the, uh, Wade Whipple from the film franchise. The film takes place between the events of Sonic the Hedgehog 2 and Sonic the Hedgehog 3, which is slated to hit theatres in December the 20th, 2024. In the series, Knuckles agrees to train Wade as his protege and teach him the ways of the Echidna Warrior per the official logline. Uh, Eddie Patterson, The Righteous Gemstones, Julian Barrett, Mindhorn, Scott Muscudi, Muscudi, Don't Look Up, and Ellie Taylor, Ted Lasso will recur in the series. Roy McCann from Game of Thrones will guest star, as well as Tika Sumter reprising her role as Maddie from the films. Additional casting will soon be announced at a later date. Production on the series is now underway in London. John Whittingen, Whittington, if I can talk, who worked on the screenplay for Sonic the Hedgehog 2, wrote the pilot for Knuckles, and serves as the head writer and executive producer on the series. It's always good when you've got um, uh, someone who wrote the screenplay for the movies, and now he's writing the pilot for the Knuckles show as well, because then there's a bit of... Um, you know, there's you have the same writer working on both films, so there's a bit of cohesancy between the films and the TV shows, which is good. Sometimes it can be a bit jarring if you've got a movie and then a TV show with different writers, and it can feel completely different from each other, and it doesn't feel connected. So this is good news that the same writer is on the show and um, and on the movies as well. Uh, serve as the head writer, executive producer on the series, Brian Schatter uh, and James Majeski, also writers. Jeff Fowler, who directed the Sonic the Hedgehog films, will direct the pilot episode and executive produce the series. Neil H. Moritz and Toby Ashka are the original film, and Toru Nakahara, all members of the film's creative team, serve to executive producers and does Elba. Ged White, Brandon Trost, Jorma Tacone, and Carol Banker are also directing episodes. Paramount Pictures and Sega of America will produce. Sonic the Hedgehog was released in theaters in February 2020, with a sequel, sequel debuting in April of 2022. In total, two films have earned over 405 million at the global box office. So these films, you know, that you know, people love these films, but they don't they don't make a whole lot of money at the box office, which is a shame. Hopefully, with um, the new series coming out and people getting excited. Also, I think Mario is going to do a lot for um, video game franchises as well. Hopefully, that will boost Sonic 3's box office. Um, all we need to see is an upward trajectory um, in terms of box office for these movies, and hopefully they keep making them. So what do you guys think about think about this new uh, Knuckles TV show coming out on Paramount Plus? I'd love to hear your thoughts. Jump into the comment section, and I'll see you soon.